Hi guys, Chris again, and in this video I wanted to do some more talking about unsupported GPUs. So with the ending of driver support for the GTX 1000 and 900 series, aka Pax, uh, Pascal and Maxwell, um, this, is, this is a big thing people are talking quite a bit about. So I have two GPUs here. This is an AMD Radeon uh, R9 Fury. Is it Fury X? Fury? Uh, I don't know. There's like a bunch of different versions of Fury. Uh, Fury Nitro. R9 Fury Nitro. And this is a uh, GTX 1080 Ti Asus ROG Strix version. Uh, now, the thing these two GPUs both have in common is that <clears throat> they are both unsupported, right? So this is a lot more unsupported. It's more unsupported -er than this. This just became unsupported. This has been unsupported for quite a while. Now, if you watch the hysterics that some people have are putting out on YouTube, you would think that if you have one of these, you just, you need to replace it now. <clears throat> that is ridiculous. So this GPU, and, I, and I'm going to preface this with, I don't, this isn't always the case. I have seen a few issues, but generally speaking, my finding with GPUs like this, I think that this is from 2015-ish. So this is a little over 10 years old, about 11 years old now, pretty soon. <coughs> um, what I have found is that as a general rule, any game that this is otherwise capable of supporting all you know, driver optimizations and stuff aside, I find that generally speaking that these run and are able to run as you would expect it to based on what the hardware is, taking any driver optimization considerations out. Now, occasionally I will come across something that has issues that the hardware in theory shouldn't, but that is not the rule. That is the exception. That is unusual. That is not something I run into constantly. It will be the random game here or there. It is not a, a, a real big problem. Um, typically, uh, actual support for a game is generally more related to does the hardware and the feature level support uh, allow it? Um, so if you have a GPU like a 1080 Ti, fear not. You've, you've probably, I mean, there's always a possibility something breaks, but if you're already happy with what this can do, chances are um, you've probably got at least a year. I'm going to bet at least a year before you start seeing real problems. I'm going to bet probably more, but safe, I would say at least a year. Anyway, I hope you guys find this information useful and thanks for watching.